Hello everyone, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Ridwan Ibrahim. In this video, I will be showing you the new update in the Stonebridge Structural Detailing Template version 2024. Uh, basically, what the Stonebridge template does is that it makes your detailing work easier and faster. It has a series of detailed drawings done in AutoCAD which you can use. You can just pick anyone and then use it as a template for your detailed works and that will make your work easier and faster. Um, for example, if you make your structural design with Sprater structure and then you get your drawing in Plotter details, the drawing will not be perfect. It will not even be professional to use it directly like that on site. So you have to do some editings on the drawing. Basically, that will take a lot of your time. But having Stonebridge templates, you can easily make those editing faster and easier. You can easily change the line width, the line type, the color, and all the pen assignments that you do not have in the Prota details. All will be fixed with just a click of your mouse using the Stonebridge detailing template. You can also do um, some other things which I will show you in this video. All right. So this is the 2024 version. Initially, the Stonebridge template was made for the users of Prital Structure. So if you look carefully to the top right corner of this, you will see the logo of Prital Structure. You will see that of Prital Details and you will see that of Prital Steel. Basically, this is for users of Prital Structure. So if you use Prital Structure for your structural design, then you can easily use Stonebridge templates. That was the initial thing. However, in the 2024 version, it has been upgraded so that users of StartPro and users of Orion can also use this template. Okay, so now the users of Preta Structure, the users of StartPro, and users of Orion can actually use this template. So that is one upgrade that is made to the 2024 version of Stonebridge Detailing Catalog. All right, another is that. Um, in the previous version there was no template for power foundation so when you have your building situated on a power foundation you do not have templates for that kind of detail in the previous version however in the 2024 version there is now a template for power foundation also in the earlier version stonebridge detailing templates can only be used for reinforced concrete detail drawing but in the 2024 version, the ability has further been increased to steel detailing drawings. Okay, so let me show you how it works and how you can use it. You need to have this Excel sheet. Then from the Excel sheet, you can directly go to the AutoCAD file. So let's click on a uh, building situated on Power Foundation. Okay, fine. This is the template for um, structural detail drawings using the PAL foundation template. Now, if you zoom in on this, this is the PAL cap detail. You can see here you have three PALs and you have one PAL cap. And then you can see the column and you definitely know why the column is arched because that is continuous. Um, you have all that. If you check the section detail, you can see the section where you have your PAL and you have your PAL cap. So you have your column. Um, you can check a section like this section that shows you the section detail of the power it also shows the section detail of the pie cap and a little bit section detail of the of the column all right so let's see a detail of the power itself okay so here we have one this is a power rebar detail okay so this is how your detailing of a pile is expected to be so if you don't have this or you do not know how to detail um, a power then you can easily use this and then you just make adjustments let's say for example you want to detail um, a power you are a draftsman and the engineer or you are the engineer you are doing the design and also doing the detailing so you've gotten your results from whatever software you are using be it Prota structure or tecla and then your power says that okay you should have 10 numbers of riba of 20 mm so how are you going to design how are you going to draft that you can easily pick this one and then you just make amends to the um to the drawing for example um let's see the length of this particular power this power is 31 meter 
so if yours is 22 meter all you just need to do is make edits you can just um, double click on this and here that you have 31 meter all you just need to do is change this to um, 22 right 22 okay and then you have this it does not need to be drawn to scale and then you check your rebar okay you want to provide how many numbers you want to provide 10 numbers of rebar um actually this is the link okay so the link the link is t10 yours might be y10 it might be r10 it might be 8 okay so this is 10 mm and the spacing is 200 if this is what you have then you can leave this if this is different from what you have for example if yours is y8 then you can just change it to um y8 you know to make edits to this is very easy so um you can just do all that and then also for the main bars and others you can just um go ahead and change all that and then you produce this as your actual drawing okay so that makes your work easier and faster because when you are detailing piles you are detailing pie cap you are detailing beams they are usually in the same form the only thing that differs is the span and then the arrangement of the rebars okay so and that is not a big deal you can actually change the span anyhow you wish to have it because you don't need to draw to scale okay you can easily manipulate your drawing and make it faster using this uh template all right there are about four operations the stone bridge templates can do for you however in this particular video i am only concerned about the update what is new in the 2024 version so if you want to know the whole operations this template can do for you then you can just check my previous video that i made on the 2023 version of the stonebridge structural detailing template the link of the video will be attached in the description of this particular video so that you can watch and understand how you can properly use the template also, if you would like to purchase the Stonebridge 2024 version, you will get my detail in the description of this video so that you can contact me and uh, purchase it. So I've shown you the update of the power foundation. Also, I will need to show you the update of the, um, of the steel detailing template. So we also have the steel detailing template. Let's see that. Okay, that has loaded up and then if you um, zoom closely, you will see this is a 3d drawing all right so this is a 3d view so you can easily use this as a template okay so here the cladding has been removed okay you can see some cladding over here so the cladding can be removed and then you can see the whole frame so this is a 3d framing um all the details like the details of um the braces the elevation um also the the foundation part okay so where you have your plinth so your plane and your steel connections all that here you have your anchor so you can see your anchor you have your anchor plate your workshop and then your sleeve pipe all steel detail that you can need for your steel detail you can actually pick it from here and try to manipulate it to suit what you want to produce for your for your client or for your contractor so um this is another update first i've shown you the pow foundation update i've also shown you the steel updates um, let's see the other updates here you also have the start pro detailing you have the soft tool, uh, you have the orion and you also have um bar bending shadow okay you also have the bar bending shadow so let me click on the start pro it will just load up the um being on part foundation for you you can also do the same thing for orion so here is the template for the um, Orion users. Okay, so you can see basically it's just the building situated on uh, a part footing that is available for now for Orion users and for Start Pro users. So you can easily use the template. So if you are interested in getting the template, you can always contact me. I will drop my contact detail in the description of this video. Thank you for watching.